This week is Hurricane Preparedness Week, and to start us off, our island meteorologist Paul Drews takes a look at past seasons and shows us what Hawaii can learn from its history with hurricanes. While this hurricane season is not expected to be a busy one for the Central Pacific, as forecasters expect one to four named storms, there's still the threat of one hitting Hawaii. Even when we have very few tropical cyclones in the Central Pacific, that that can still be a major impact depending on where those, those hurricane, potential hurricanes go. Last season was a relatively quiet one. We got off to a very late start as well as the first name storm didn't form until July 4th. Most of the storms formed and stayed in the eastern Pacific until mid-August when Hone formed in the central Pacific and strengthened into a hurricane before passing just 60 miles to the south of the Big Island. Then Gilma, which formed in the eastern Pacific and grew into a Category 4 hurricane before entering the central Pacific. It then weakened and disappeared before reaching the state. Two storms that came close but did not make a direct hit on our islands. And over the years, Hawaii has had a number of close calls. I worry about complacency. We, we've had a lot of near misses. I worry about people seeing these hurricanes pass by, not having data in front of them and not preparing for the next one. Even storms that miss Hawaii can still impact us. Hone caused flash flooding that damaged homes and closed several roads across Hawaii County, while tropical storm force winds brought down trees and utility poles on the Big Island. Even after a tropical storm has fallen apart and winds are no longer a threat, there may be leftover moisture that could cause flooding if it moves over the state. Using ocean temperatures, winds, and large-scale dynamics, Central Pacific Hurricane Center forecasters are able to predict the number of named storms that may form in our waters this hurricane season. But those computer models can't tell us the most important thing and does not predict whether these cyclones directly impact Hawaii. We've had very active seasons where we've been lucky and not had any tropical cyclones hit the state. Paul Drews, Island News.